Morning. I failed to record an intro to that uh, yesterday, or you know, two days ago. Um, so, what's this video about? It's a road trip from Kassel to London. That's roughly 800 kilometers in total. I took the trip um, the first day uh, 500 kilometers to Bruges, where I met Janosch of Clippercap. And then next day the roughly 300 kilometers to London. Let's see how it went. So, first charge stop after 180 kilometers, 20% left. The BMS is finally doing its job, and I've arrived at my favorite chargers, the Aral, Aral Pulse, Aral Pulse, or whatever. Charging at a nice 180 amps. So, that's nice. After um, 22 minutes, we've already made it to 66%. And next stop is already in 110 kilometers, so I'm almost good to go. And I haven't even had time to finish my pretzel. And I'm very happy with the consumption figure, 14.8. Good, made it to my first destination today, Antwerp, Ant Antwerpen, whatever. And here I'm going to pick up Janosch at the train station, and then we're going to continue to Pru Bruges. And one improvement has been um, I have mounted a small fan, 120 millimeter fan, um, next to the rear battery brick, which tended to overheat. And so now when I came here, it was uh, had dropped back down to 39, and now it's it's going back up. But it seems like now I can um, I don't have to worry about uh, overheating the battery. Um, and also the first charge session was actually 70 kilowatts and not even that could overheat it. Very happy with that. Alright, I've made it to Ghent now. Car is parked somewhere, um, charging, slow charging. Look at the amount of bikes here. This is Ghent station. And now I will return to the car and uh, continue to Bruges. Wow, there's even a house for bikes. Check it out. Wow. That's awesome, Belgium. Good evening. My little food break gave the battery the chance to cool down to 35 degrees, and I think I can just turn off the fan now because today I'm just going another 50 kilometers to Bruges and then I will slow charge overnight. Don't need a fan for that. Good morning. We are in beautiful Brugge in Belgium and we've got a special guest here which is myself and the real man. So we're there. We drove here. Morning. Built an electric car, he drove it all the way to Brugge. We're going to drive it onto the ferry today and drive it to London today. And not only did he build it himself, he told all of you guys how to build your own cars. And I'm just here talking.
Ja, die Leistung langsam gut. Ja. Um, we've just taken the ferry from Calais to Dover. Uh, this is the first charge stop in the Touran, the one of a kind VW E Touran that Johannes has built. And the first Chatamo stop in the UK, um, with Iceland in the background. Um, I got to drive it in a car park just now. And it's quite interesting because we don't have a manual gearbox in the taxis, so. The ratio for the gear, forwards and backwards, is always the same, it's always 8 to 1. And then I put this in reverse, and I put my foot on the accelerator in the same way I would in a taxi, and all of the car, sudden the car's just shooting back, because it's obviously 0.7 instead of 1 or something, it's, it's rated higher, so I got a little scare there. Now I get to ride in the passenger seat a bit. Yeah, I'm just driving, because we are on the wrong side. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> on the wrong side of the road. How are you getting along? Pretty good. Um, it's a bit weird to drive with the steering wheel on the left hand side, on the left hand lane done that much before. It's good fun. The Touran is smoother than the taxis. Um, I think it like take off. Uh, you can tell that the programming is a bit easier on a front wheel drive than on the rear wheel drive. Um, yeah, it drives very nicely. I'm learning about shifting. I learned about shifting. I learned about reverse earlier. Now I'm learning about uh, shifting from third to fourth in a manual gearbox for combustion, combustion vehicle with an EV conversion, which is different because we just drive with a fixed gear uh, and I haven't driven many other conversions yet. Um, yeah, it's good fun. It's very smooth. I like it. Good. Back in driving school then. Back in driving school, yes. Do you want me to tell the anecdote? Go ahead. I used to, um, I learned shifting in a VW Touran back when I did my license in Germany. And now I've been taught shifting again, so I've got flashbacks from 2005. Um, that was pretty good. Oh, that's almost poetic. <laughs> it. You build an EV and you 
drove it all the way to London. Nice. <sighs> wow. <laughs> An amazing sight.